What's up, players? It's Jack from Tech Let's Plays, bringing you episode number four of my Skyrim Let's Play. So, uh, you may notice I've got this helmet on. I kind of, as I was making my way back, I, um, I managed to pickpocket this helmet. So, that's pretty cool. Anyway, we are going to go over to Whiterun. And more specifically, talk to the Hall of Right Run. Now, I've actually clocked up uh, three hours on a second character. Mm. I've actually managed to clock up uh, three hours on a second character, but by the time you see this, which will be, um, you know, a long time, it will probably be about double, if not triple that. Because um, basically, I'm recording this about 11 o'clock at night on Friday, still on release day. And um, what I'm planning on doing is uh, going back to my normal schedule where I upload overnight and schedule it to publish at 7 p.m. Central Time and with a possible double upload at 9 o'clock Central Time. So that's the format for my channel normally if you're a fairly new subscriber or just didn't know, you're an old one and didn't know. Um, so yeah, what I used to do and what I'm going to do now, it's just because of release things, I wanted to get up things early, is I upload overnight. I upload the video overnight because my internet connection is really bad. And uh, then it, I use the schedule uploader and it'll finish and it'll publish at 7pm the next day. So it's sort of a peak time. Whoa, Jesus. The wolves look really, really scary. But uh, yeah. It's really weird because I'm used to playing on this other character. Uh, I made. Oh. Wow, I must have picked something up. Because that is a nine. Alright, let's just drop some. I don't know. Am I stunned or something? Okay, I'm gonna drop something anyway. Um. Ooh, Warhammer. Um, right. I'm just gonna drop a load of stuff because I don't know why I'm walking so slowly, even still. Oh god, what the hell is going on? What the hell? Seriously. What the actual brown? Wow, what is going on here, guys? Okay. This is weird. Have I been poisoned? Oh wow. Hmm. Okay, I have no idea. I'm going to pause the recording here because this is just taking over the whole Let's Play. So I'll pause it and come back when I can move. Okay, right. Uh, I have to uh, hit the use the run button. I don't know why. I didn't have to do this on my other character. It would just run at a normal pace anyway. But never mind. I'll just do this. It's kind of inconvenient, but whatever. Um, Alright, so I kind of got off, traf uh, off topic and uh, all that slow running and shiz but yeah basically it's very very exciting what's coming up on in the game um, I was sort of debating whether I should do a second character but at the end of the day I'll, I wanna play this game man this is an awesome game um, but don't worry I'm still gonna make it entertaining and stuff and not just be like oh yeah and at this point I just find this massive spider and just you know, kill it right yeah anyway um, I'm still gonna you know make it entertaining and to be honest I'll still be I, oh jeez, what the hell was that? Actually sounds like someone getting raped outside, but it's probably just a fox. Um, right, how to get in here? See, look, I was just about to say, I'll probably forget what to do anyway, and... Like so, I have indeed completely uh, forgotten. This is so annoying, having to hold run, because on my other character I did not have to do that. 
Let me see if it's because I'm wearing, having got a uh, two-handed weapon. Um, God's sake. I don't have any one-handed weapon. Ah, oh, there we go. A dagger. Right. Nope. Still really annoyingly retarded. Woo. Must have been possibly the character. Because um, in the other one I'm playing a high elf. And I went with the... Instead of going underground with the um, the guy that was going to execute me, I went for the other parallel storyline, which is pretty much exactly the same, but he talks to different characters. I went with the blonde-haired guy that was sat in the uh, truck, like cart thing, horse and carriage, whatever. Um, pony and trap, whatever you want to call it. Um, so yeah, right, I'm going to rebind that key. Because I did originally have sprint on that key, but now that I've found out that you actually need to hit this run button, I'm going to switch them back. Right. Sorry about all this. Uh, yeah. Let's go. That's better. Alright, and I was watching, um, I was looking through some other Skyrim Let's Plays, just check out the competition, you know. Um, and uh, I saw the top comment was, wow, this texture pack's amazing. Because, uh, sort of a Minecraft joke. If you're not a fan of Minecraft, then you'll probably just be like, nah. <laughs> but, <laughs> yeah, that's exactly what you'll be like, obviously. Um, right, where do we go? That seems to be a rather large obstruction. Uh, but yeah, you can buy horses down there, which is pretty Wait. cool. I know you. No, you don't. Alright. How do I get in? Oh, right, over there. <laughs> Hello. Halt. City's closed with the dragons about. Official business only. Riverwood's in danger too. You better go on in. You'll find the Jarl in Dragon's Reach at the top of the hill. Yeah, thank you. Thank Ah, see now it's the opposite. I'm holding down W, just W, and when I hold down shift, I'm now going to say this. See, I'm really confused. I don't know what is going on. Uh, maybe there'll be a patch out. And I looked on the Steam News, and quarter of a million st uh, people were playing Skyrim on Steam uh, at some point today. I don't know what point. That is ridiculous. 250,000 people playing on just Steam alone. That's pretty crazy. I mean, I know it seems the main platform, but still, there's going to be at least some people that don't have it and that are playing it. So that's pretty crazy and pretty awesome. And another awesome and crazy fact is when you put in Let's Play on the, like, suggestions thing, Skyrim is already, like, the top God thing. So that's why I really need your support, guys, on these videos to help it. So when they uh, type in Let's Play Skyrim, mine are going to be all on that front page. <laughs> uh, I can dream. But, yeah. I don't know, seriously guys, I do need your support, like likes, favourites, comments, sharing it to Facebook and Twitter, Wait. Twitter, <laughs> um, really helps me out and it will help me, it will help uh, it get on the pages and stuff, so yeah, that would be really helpful. Oh my god. You know about Helgen? The Jarl will want to speak to you. Hell yeah, dude. Didn't you see episode three of my Let's Play? God, get with it. Yes, I had a great view while appearance was trying to cut off my head. Forthright about your criminal past. But it's none of my concern who the Imperials want to execute. Especially now. What I want to know is what exactly happened at Helgen? The Imperials are about to execute. Yeah. Sounds guess good. Ulfric would be mixed up in this. What do you say now, Proventus? Shall we continue to trust in the strength of our walls against the dragon? No, we didn't circle me. To so dramatic. In the most immediate danger. Look at him with his swagger. He'll assume we're preparing to join Ulfric's side and attack him. We should Enough. not. 
I'll not stand idly by while the dragon burns my hold and slaughters my people. Smash him in the nut right now. Yeah. Yes, my Just gonna change my weapon. Sorry about that. Excuse me. I'll return to my duties. That would be best. Well done. Here, take this. There. Yeah. Is another thing you could do for me. Suitable for someone of your particular talents. Hey, thank you. Come, let's go find Faringar, my court wizard. He's been looking into a matter related to these dragons and rumors of dragons. Okay. A whiny little kid. You're a spoiled baby. I'm going to tell father you said that. He'll tan your hive to dirt. Father says I'm too young to train with the sword, so I practice with my fists. Yeah, cool then. <laughs> Absurd that you can't cook good sweet rolls in the skeever hole of a city. Yeah, whatever. Father says I'm too young to train with the sword. Yeah, go away, you stupid kids. Right, hello. Come to Dragon's Reach to discuss the ongoing hostility. Ah, indeed. Oh, his chin. Oh yes, he must be long face. my research into the dragon. Yes, I could use someone to fetch something for me. Well, when I say fetch, I really mean delve into a dangerous ruin in search of an ancient stone tablet that may or may not actually be there. Right, what am I going Straight to be to the fetching? Point, eh? No need for tedious hows and whys. I like that. Leave those details to your betters, am I right? I uh, learned of a certain stone tablet said to be housed in Bleak Falls Barrow. A dragon stone said to contain a map of dragon burial sites. Go to Bleak Falls Barrow, find this tablet, no doubt interred in the main chamber, and bring it to me. Simplicity itself. Alright, um... Oh, that'll be it, thank you. Yeah, yeah, I'm going. Uh, I'm just going to stock up on some food. Good with food. Um, right, so the salt. Get that. Oh, there's any apples in there. God damn it, I need salt. Take the cheese. Take some potatoes. Should be able to get enough stuff to make a nice vegetable stew I mean soup uh, take some more leeks take some cheese, bread, wine oh it's gonna be a rather handy dandy time right uh, let's see what I can make if I go over here and use the cooking spit food apple cabbage stew cabbage potato stew Vegetable soup. Just keep making these. Um, right. There's more f uh, ingredients down there. Ooh, we've got some garlic there. Carrots. Nice bit of carrot. Ooh. Um, right, yeah, that'll do for now. Take some salmon. Harvest that. Uh, just gonna see if we can do a nice little uh, salmon dish. Get a bit of meat. Ooh, salmon steak. Oh, lovely. Salt pile, two salmon meat. So it was ten health and ten salmon. Ah, uh, do I go for the nice salmon or do I go for the more practical tomato? Gonna have to go for the smarty soup, guys. Gotta watch my weight. <laughs> Uh, right, so let's uh, let's head off to this dangerous dwelling, or whatever he said it was called, and uh, let's go there. Onwards, out. That looks like a cool helmet. Codlack Whitemane is the harbinger of the companions. Oh, it's getting dark and there's no beds around. I don't think. Bom, 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 bom. They want to back the storm cloaks. I find it funny how they use the word oblivion instead of hell. 
It's very funny. That's why I called my first episode What the Oblivion? Because uh, in one of the cutscenes, he's like, he says something like that. He's like, What an Oblivion? Ooh, is there an animal in here? Ooh, apples, yeah. Oh my god, there is as well. I wish I could ride it. Um, I'm not gonna kill it. Alright. Uh, Ooh, jeez. Okay, um. Let's go. Lego. Do 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 do. It's really funny, on my second character I tried to steal a horse, but it failed epically. It was rather amusing. Right, bruv. Wait, I know you. Wait, I know you. There's no mistake. You're a wanted man, and it's time to pay for your crimes. What? You know what? You're not worth the hassle. Go. Be some other god's problem. Uh, thank God for that, because I wasn't in the mood for a justice system. And oh, wow, that looks like a cool thing. Right, let's uh, let's head off into the mountains. Just have to do it while it gets dark, doesn't it? The scariest time of day, and we have to do it then. Um, got to find an unowned bed though. If I do want to make it not day, but never mind. Right, we shall save because if that's one thing I learnt is that um, you have to save regularly because if you don't save and you die, you have to go all the way back again. So not fun, not fun indeed. But I'm just gonna sprint over there and get there as quick as I can. And when I get there, I think we shall wrap it up. So then it's on a nice little cliffhanger for episode 5 where we can uh, start doing some cool stuff into the dwelling because there's lots of puzzles and shit oh my god that scared the christ out of me bam bam sit down Sanjay uh, oh level up um I'm literally just gonna scale this mountain it's vertical uh, I gotta get it. Oh uh, yeah, like a boss. And uh, let's see. Ah, uh, now where? Uh, oh god, that's pretty steep. Ah. Oh. Alright, let's just go round the side of this mountain here. Hopefully we won't slip and fall to a very painful death. That's always nice if you don't. Oh. Alright. Jump. Jump, jump, jump. Okay. Oh man. Um. Ah. Jeez, that sounded like it hurt. You right there, buddy? Uh, sound like he twisted his ankle saying, Ooh, snowberries. Gotta be on the lookout for these uh, cheeky wolves. Or sneaky wolves, as you probably call them. Very sneaky. Oh, wow. Oh, Jesus. Just as I started admiring the scenery. Wow. Wow. Well, if that doesn't deserve a like, then I don't know what does, because that is unbelievably amazing graphics and just awesome scenery. And shut up, moped. Bloody chavs riding around. Going like 10 miles an hour. Ooh. Oh, there's a blizzard. Blizzard coming in. Alright, Bleak Falls Barrow discovered. So I'm going to cut it off here, guys. Make sure you subscribe so you don't miss episode 5. We'll be going inside this cool temple thing. And trust me, you don't want to miss that.
Make sure you like the video and add it to your favourites as well as it helps my channel grow and helps others find this video, which would be really already awesome. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Peace.